bobcat sighting has surprised people living in St. John's County. Oh, that bobcat spotted in the backyard of a home in the Durban Crossing subdivision. This is cell phone video taken earlier. Shows a fairly large bobcat roaming through a children's backyard playground there. Mm. News for Jackson reporter Eric Avenier is joining us live after talking to that family about their four-legged visitor. Eric? Well, Kent, that four-legged visitor just appears from out of the bushes without warning and disappears back into the woods without warning, of course. And I have to say that the family we spoke to and their neighbors aren't taking any chances, even though this uh, bobcat has not attacked anyone. He was hanging out in here like it was cat litter. Howard Flashin is talking about this large bobcat in his backyard that was captured on cell phone video. There's one characteristic about the cat that can't be denied. It was big, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, so it, it's a it's a bit. It looked like a big cat from where we are. We were inside the house, so we were nice and safe. But uh, it was a big cat. I would imagine that my two year old probably wouldn't have had a chance. Flashin says his family believes they saw the same bobcat six months ago and it was much smaller. Now it's a fairly larger cat that is freely roaming onto the children's play area. So no outside for the kids unattended? <laughs> for a little while until we get lazy again, yeah. According to the Florida Fish and Wildlife Commission, bobcats grow to the size of a small to mid-sized dog and can typically weigh between 15 and 35 pounds. Bobcats only eat meat such as rabbits, rats, and raccoons. Bobcats also don't need a large amount of land to hunt prey. Well, as you can see, this preserve actually backs up to the property, so any animal could walk out of here onto the backyard playground. In an area where you build homes on a preserve, you're kind of invading their territory, so you've got to expect snakes and bobcats, alligators. Now the Flashins also have a small dog that's about this big that could easily be taken by that bobcat, which is why the family pet is not allowed to be out in the backyard by itself. Reporting live, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.